Oh, oh my God, guys. Uh, <laughs> this video is a very exciting one for me. Honestly, you have no idea. Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. My name is Adele Awali. If you're new, thank you for stopping by. I'm the content creator behind the fashion blog Passion Heavenly, where I share my modest, um, colorful, bright, bold um, style. On my blog, I inspire my mid-sized curvy girls who are not um, plus size, neither are they slim, to inject color, beautiful, bright, bold colors into their everyday style and to look fabulous. Also on my blog, I share everything beauty from skincare, from um, makeup um, to my personal style. Um, I also share my lifestyle, um, a little bit of my family um, on my blog. So please make sure that you check my blog out on www.passionheavily.com. Also, I'm very, um, active on social media and i think I'm, I'm more active on instagram so hey if you're on instagram as well if you like what you see here on my um youtube consider subscribing to my youtube channel click that notification bell below um so that every time that i i post um, a video you will be notified also don't forget to give me a thumbs up um everything i mentioned um in today's video will always be in the will be in the description bar below as usual um check me out on instagram if you like my feed please um consider following me on instagram i share my everyday life on my instagram stories so you can see what i'm up to with my family or just maybe by myself so without further ado let's get into today's video okay ladies so today i'm sharing one of my favorite things ever i'm a huge huge and i put emphasis on huge i'm a huge handbag lover and i you know my, even my husband knows um i ways that i you know show myself love is by buying myself luxury items um and i do this a couple of times in a year i you know i don't do it all the time but when i do it it's always um pieces that i know that for sure i'm gonna see in the next two three years and i'm still gonna love and you know i consider all my um bags investment pieces so i've been seeing um this a video that people have been doing um which has to do with um their luxury items that they uh, got for last year and i thought oh that's very um exciting and i have few items also that i got last year and i just wanted to kind of share that with you um in today's video okay so let's start with my dior bag this is actually my first um dior that I, I would get and with all my handbags i make sure that um you know i keep them um in their dust bag that they come with that's how i store my bags i don't really um put them in keep them in their boxes all the boxes for my bags or my shoes or whatever is in the basement just because uh, my cloth fix is not um too big and speaking of my cloth fix I just shared um, in my last video, um, you know, my Clawfix reveal. So if you are interested and you want to check that out, I'll leave that in the comment, um, in the description bar below as well. So going back to my bag, my Dior bag. So it's a small, it's not um, this season, obviously. Um, this is what it looks like. I don't know if you guys can see it. It says Dior, this is what it looks like. I'll leave all the names and um, links to where you can get these bags um, in the description below. So um, like I said, this is my first Dior. I got this last year and um, it's a crossbody bag. So you can put it on your shoulder or you can hold it as um, a clutch. So that's, that's how it opens up. And I always fill my bags with either tissues or paper. Um, that's what it looks like. So let me take that out for you guys so you can see. That's all that I have in there stuffed in there just so it doesn't lose um, the shape. That's what it looks like. It's a wallet on chain style bag. Um, hence it has all those um, card space and that's um, from Nordstrom, um, 
that's the receipt from Nordstrom and that's what the inside looks like looks looks like that's what it looks like so that's what it looks like without the stuffing as you can see it's very flat and um if you if i don't put i find with my bags if i don't put all the stuffing in there like i said it's gonna lose its shape um yeah so that's what it looks like and again i always store all my bags in their dust bag that they come with. okay guys so moving on to the next one this is very exciting for me because the hubs got this for me for our 15th year anniversary last year so this is what the baby looks like Ooh. can you see can you can you guys see how excited i am just because of bags that's how much i love my bags so this is a valentino rock stud um large um bag so it opens up like so like that and just like um all my bags i stuff them either with paper or with tissue just to kind of again keep um their shape that's all i have in there i i think i have i need to put more in this it's not enough anyways moving forward so with this strap like i said it's a gold um chain and you can either carry it cross body and I'll leave what it looks like, um, um, how I've styled it in the past, I'll leave it up here somewhere. So you can um, style it um, with the long chain, either as a shoulder bag, or like I said, as a cross body. So um, it's actually big enough for all my essentials um it's big it's pink in there as well i love the color um it has some paper in there um that's the valentino paper i believe and um yeah uh it's from holt renfield i don't know if you guys can see but anyways um so i just kind of put that in there um so that's what the bag looks like i'm super excited love 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 this bag because like i said it's from the hubby from last year um for our 15th year wedding anniversary so this one for sure um it's not going anywhere it's going to be in my collection for a very long time and i might i might even pass it to any of my um, daughters um whoever is interested <laughs> So um, the next item is a pair of shoes. Like I said, um, I have four bags to share with you today and then I have a bag. So um, I put my, I don't know, this is kind of weird, but I really don't like my um, shoes. You know how people have their shoes like laid out, um, arranged nicely and you know, just kind of see it every day. <sighs> I'm sorry, I'm not that girl. Um, I'm very organized. I like my space to be free um, of clutter. I don't really like clutter. And tr trust me, that look is beautiful. But for me, I don't really like it because I don't like dust getting on my stuff, especially with, you know, luxury items. <laughs> I put it out there um, and yeah, dust will get onto it. So anyways, um, back to the shoes. So I store my, my shoes in their dust bag, like I said, with the bags as well. And then with the shoes, I just put them in these plastic um, boxes that I got from, I think, Canadian Tire or something. But I'm going to leave it in the description bar. I'm going to leave similar ones in the descri description bar below. Um, I, I also spoke about um, these boxes in my Clawfix um, video. Uh, the last video that I did, I think it's my Clawfix video. Yeah. So I'll leave that video in the description bar as well if you're interested to check that out okay enough rambling let's get into the shoes um with the shoes i actually was um pulling out some clothes or some outfits um to shoot content and i totally had a bra uh, carry bradshaw moment and i just put it on my instagram so if you're not following me that's one of the reasons why you should follow me on instagram because i post like i said i post every day i post in my stories and i just sometimes randomly i just post you know how i'm feeling so anyways um this is what the shoes look like oh it's a manolo blonic um hagassi that's what it looks like guys oh my god i got this um for myself last year for my birthday last year i've always always wanted this um shoes but you know i got it in my favorite color so this is this is my favorite color blue this metallic cobalt 
royal blue is my favorite color and i just had to have it guys i mean look how pretty this is i actually have um this style of um shoes the exact one but in red i got that i think a couple years ago but i got this one last year and i mean look at that i've i've only won it within the house like um i think i wore it for the christmas um shoot that i had with my family i'll leave that up um in the description bar um up here in the car so you can see and i'll leave links to this if you want to get yourself a pair um in the description bar below absolutely absolutely love this and for a uh, size reference i'm a 40 i don't know if you guys can see but i'm a 40 so that's what it looks like absolutely absolutely love and adore the shoes you guys have no idea i'm thinking of getting another color that's how much i love them because they don't really hurt my feet like i want um the red one for a party um in i believe in malta when i went to malta two years ago now oh my god it's almost two years yeah in, two years ago i wore the red one so i'll leave that up um up here as well for you to see that's what it looks like Woo! this shoe still gives me butterflies oh my god <laughs> okay guys so the next bag sticking to the blue um palette we were aware uh, on is my Paragamo. Oh, oh my god guys <laughs> this video is a very exciting one for me honestly you have no idea um i love my bags i love 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 my bags i don't play with my bags i love my bags and this when i saw it oh, oh my god guys you have no idea oh i absolutely love this bag so this is um um a salvatore ferragamo bag and um oof ciao ciao can we just mm, take a moment absolutely absolutely love and adore this bag um so it opens up like so love the leather it comes with a strap as well it comes with a strap um i feel that's one of the things that you know made me kind of um try shoulder bags um because obviously because of the strap um you know you can wear it in dual ways you can I either carry it as a clutch like that like that right or you can use um your strap so that's one of the reasons why i'm falling in love more and more with um shoulder bags i never used to be a shoulder bag girl i you know i'm always a big um, top handle kind of girl like if you've seen my again my claw fix uh, video you need to go check that out um, I had out some of my um, collection on there just to kind of see um, what my not all but some of my collection in there um, back to this bag so um, again with the tissue right there and um, I had oh I think this is like a receipt when my husband um I needed to go um size up my ring um earlier this year or was it last year? I think that's why I don't know why that's in there, but anyways, so with this bag it has three um three spaces that you can store your belongings in there. It has this smaller one, and it has this big one, and also has like a zipper in there. So let me see, I always have stuff in there. So let me see what I have in there. Yeah, I told you I always have stuff in there. So this is um, the Ferragamo um, card that always comes with every bag and it has another hole in there. Um, there's nothing in there and it has another space that i can put my hand um, my phone in there but it's kind of small my my phone might not fit i don't put my phone in there anyways um but that's what it looks like my ferragamo uh again again i'm trying to i don't want to butcher the names of these bags guys so i'm just going to leave everything in the description bar below um as usual so that's what it looks like again i'm going to leave what it looks like um on me and um up here so you guys um can see okay babes um the last bag for this video is another valentino 
it's another Valentino bag. I think this actually started my love for Valentino bags. I already have uh, two pair of shoes, I believe, and a belt. No, I have a Ferragamo belt, not a Valentino. Anyways, um, I I got this bag also last year and, and this started my love for Valentino um, bags. It's the Rockstar um, camera bag. Uh, when I got it, I just got it just because I love this studs. I didn't know I was gonna fall in love with it. Guys, this bag is very small. And like I said, I'm a handheld bigger um, size bag girl. So when I got this, I was like, eh, I would return it. I was thinking, I will prob probably return it, but guys, I've had it for going on a year now, if not over a year, and I'm loving and loving and loving this bag. It has loads and loads of tissue in there um, because it has room. Guys, when I tell you this bag is huge for all my um, essentials, look at that. Like, look at that. Look how big that is. So it fits my phone, my sunglasses, hand cream, hand sanitizer, like it fits a lot of things. If you guys want me to do like um, a review, like a review on each bag, or you want a comparison of say, for example, um, this Valentino with um, the other um, pink Valentino that I showed, which is uh, also the Rockstar. Um, I think it's called the Large Lock, something like that. Um, I'll leave both um, side by side up here so you guys can see let me know if you want me to do like a side by side um, comparison of both um, this bag and the pink Valentino let me know in the comment section I, I would love to do that if you guys are up for it also another one I just kind of random randomly I'm thinking about is doing like um, the Manolo Blonix, I do have it in the BB Pumps um, style. So I can actually do like a comparison. Woo, I, look at your girl, I'm on fire. Like, woo, 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 I'm on fire. I'm just kind of thinking of ideas, video ideas that can um, be exciting, you know, like compare, um, we can do different brands or we can do the same brand but different style of either the bag or the shoes like let me know in the comment section what you guys want to see do you guys want to see comparison of this rockstar both rockstar bag they are both obviously both from valentino they are both the rockstar um line but then there are two different types of um, styles of bags so let me know if you want me to do that uh, for the manolo as well like i said i have the bb pumps this is the agassi so let me know I can do a comparison of the BB pumps, which is very plain, um, to this one that is very dressy. So we could do, I could do a comparison of both. Again, I'll leave what both shoes look like here so that you can see, and then tell me in the description bar below if you want me to do like a comparison of both um, um, shoes. Yeah, that would be a fun video. Okay, guys, your girl got carried away with some videos just popping, video ideas just popping up right in front of you. Anyways, back to this bag. So like I was saying, um, this is a camera bag from Valentino. Um, it's it's called the Rockstar, uh, Valentino Rockstar camera bag. That's what it's called. This is the only bag I remember the name. So that's what it's called. That's for you guys to know how much I really love it. I love all my bags. That's the thing about me. I don't spend a dime on anything. Even things that I get from Zara, I don't spend a dime on things that I don't love. Like this outfit right now is just a brown um, turtleneck um, and a vest. I have uh, a blog post on vest if you are interested. They're very transitional um, pieces that I love and they're a staple in my closet. So if you're interested, I'll leave that blog post be, uh, in the um, description bar below um, for you guys to go read up on it. So. Oh my God, girl, you are just rumbling. Get into today's bag, gosh. Okay, back to today's video. So um, this bag really surprised me because I didn't even think I was gonna like it that much, but what it got here, I find myself using it literally every time I had to go out. Like that's how much I I, I surprised myself and I love it. Um, it takes up a lot of items, like it has a lot of space in there. It's kind of suede. It's actually suede in there and it has that rock stud going on um, in there as well. It has just one pocket in there. Let's see what your girl got in there as well. Oh, it's um from Nordstrom. It's, I don't know if you guys can see. 
it's from Nordstrom. It's um, the card. So again, I just kind of put everything, leave everything in the bag. Um, yeah, so that's what it looks like. That's the back and that's the front. So that's what it looks like. Also, um, with this one, um, the strap is not detachable. Unlike the other ones that I showed you, the um, other bags that I showed you, they are all detachable. But this strap with the Rockstar um, camera bag is not detachable. You have to wear it, it as it is. So if you want to carry for like a date night, either you carry it shoulder or um, cross body, but you cannot take off um, the strap. But apart from that, I think this bag is a winner. Absolutely love it as well. Love, love, love the tan color. Um, it goes with everything in my closet and, you know, it's just an amazing bag um, to have in my collection. So if you're interested, um, I would leave um, a link in the description bar below as well. Um, if you would like to get your hands on um, yeah on it okay guys so that's it for today's video i hope you enjoy it let me know in the comment section which of these bags are you gravitating towards which of these bags do you love which color do you love um do you have any um of um this name brand do you have a ferragamo bag do you have a valentino bag do you have a manolo let me know in the comment section